Hey everybody, I'm Derek Salmon. It's the first day of the year 2017 and I am on the beach in Wisconsin and we are looking for as many birds as we can find on the first day. Come join us in this episode of Badgerland Birding. First bird of the year. What's it gonna be? I see nothing. It's a good try though. There he is, my official first bird of the year, the male house sparrow. He is by some steam. That's two. Dude, morning dove. Oh yeah. I think my first was technically hearing the house sparrows, and that's it's like the worst that it gets. We're heading to Lake Michigan to find as many birds in one day as we can. Our route takes us south along the shore, starting in Sheboygan, then heading to Port Washington, and finally finishing up in Milwaukee. While we hoped to find some rare winter ducks and gulls, we started out spotting some of the more common species from the car. We just saw some Canada geese flying over. Let's see if I can get a shot. Although I didn't get that shot, we did see Canada geese at almost every other location we went to. See the yellow bell in the sun? Yep, European starling. There he is. Bro. Bro? Yeah. Pigeons. That sound hot. We just arrived here in Sheboygan. There's some gulls loafing out on the ice. Sun's in our face. There might be one common, one red-breasted. Common merganser. I think there's a red-breasted merganser on the ice. Yes, that's the one that I saw. Oh, okay. Mallards. Scop. I'm trying to see if there's a buffalo head that keeps diving. Yep, female buffalo head. Definite ring build doll. See the, the ring in the bill? Hair and doll. A little further up the coast, we were excited to find a long tailed duck. There she is. From the Sheboygan Harbor, we moved inland to a small patch of forest. There's so many birds out right now. Red-bellied woodpecker. White breasted nuthatch. <laughs> He's like dive bombing them. The great tit. Dude, we saw the great tit. It was so cool. After spending some time in the woods, we decided to head south to the Port Washington Harbor. Here in Port Washington now, I definitely see a coot. An American coot. Right here. Probably the most American thing there is. I love the way they just paddle. After seeing the coot, we got a close-up look at our second great blackback gull. They frequent the Lake Michigan coast in winter and are also the largest gull species in the world. 
Is he the one that's still up? Yeah, he's coming towards us. There he is. Yep, male hooded. Look at that hood. He's regal. While watching ducks in the harbor, we were lucky enough to catch a glimpse of the fastest bird in the world, the peregrine falcon. It's still attacking stuff in there. Yep. We just saw this falcon, peregrine, trying to attack some of the ducks and gulls, and now it's landed on this building. Pleased with our sighting, we are feeling very optimistic. I feel, it's very pleasant out. Yeah, it's really nice. It feels like spring. It feels like March 1st instead of January 1st. Yep, it's right there. Where? In my camera. See that? We found a lot of cool stuff here in Port Washington. And the two things that we thought we would probably find here that we didn't were ruddy ducks and redheads. And so we're going to head down the coastline to see if we can find those and anything else that might be a cool thing to add on for the day. While scanning the harbor, we found one more species we were looking for. There is a ruddy duck here. You can see him kicking. Sweet. From Port Washington, we headed down to Milwaukee, where we saw many different bird species, including a variety of gulls. We were excited to get great looks at an Iceland gull, one of the gulls that's only present in Wisconsin during the winter. They can be identified by their all-white wingtips, elegant looking appearance, and size comparable to that of a herring gull. Also present was a Thayer's gull. Thayer's gulls can be identified by their rounded head, dark eyes, and white underside of their wingtips. These subtleties can make them difficult to identify, especially at long range. Fortunately, we got a very close look at this one. We stopped at an overlook and saw that there were a lot of birds out on the water. We decided to go in for a closer look. There's actually a lot of ducks out there. As we walked on, we were able to identify a few new species to add on to our list. There's a gadwall. Redhead. Sweet, two mute swans. Good find. Having been at the lake for most of the day, we hadn't yet had a chance to see a lot of the common feeder birds, such as northern cardinals. We headed to Grant Park in Milwaukee in hopes of finding these species. First of year cardinal. Nice. Is it still there? Yep. Pretty far up though, huh? Yeah. You just They're so cute. So Ryan, how excited are you for the first of the year brown creeper? That was a surprise bird. It's a good bird to get. They're cool. They always only go up the tree, never down the tree. With darkness approaching, we decided to head home. Additional species we saw but did not get video of included blue jays, rough-legged hawks, and American black ducks. We ended the day with 44 species total. Join us again next time on Badgerland Birding. Someone's actually out here paddle boarding on January 1st. This is crazy.